Tactical Strike is a is a blend of the action play that's in SOCOM, but it has a really a more realistic and tactical focus on the squad play. You command four Navy SEALs at the same time as a fire team or two elements, and it really has to do a lot with field position and cover and suppression, and it's uh, for people that enjoy a little more of a, a tactical RTS kind of feel, it's a, it's a nice hybrid of the two. Bravo is covered. Thanks, Abel. You always have an element of four seals, but you have the option to break them into elements of two or to use them individually. So I may have upgraded my sniper skills and specifically outfitted one seal with a sniper rifle and suppression and certain equipment, and I may peel him off and work with him very, very specifically in setting up crossfires or overwatch, and then work with the rest of the squad and sort of build the strategy. The entire game takes place sort of in South America, in Panama, and there's nine very large campaign missions and then a host, a full, full set of multiplayer modes on those maps. Yes. We brought back almost every classic SOCOM multiplayer mode, so suppression, uh, demolition, uh, extraction, those sorts of modes, but we also have a brand new mode just for tactical strike that we call collateral damage. That's a very fun two versus two co-op mode where two teams of mercenaries are just trying to blow up every car and the, the special forces teams have to try and stop them. The game's a pretty deep toolkit for building your special forces characters. We don't mandate what you do with them, but every special forces member of your team, every SEAL for example, has a lot of different skills that you can upgrade and then you completely customize their loadout. But then the core characters themselves, this game is fully localized, so there's nine different teams of special forces. So you can play as British SAS, Korean 707, German KS9, Australian SASR, you can play as the French, German, Italian. There's a lot you can do with sort of creating your ultimate special forces team. We got you covered. Move out now. Thanks, Abel. Folks, we've got trouble. Right here in Panama City. Ooh. Trouble with a capital I, and that stands for insurgents. The insurgents are being rounded up by our security forces as we speak. Awkward. SOCOM U.S. Navy SEALs makes another bow on the PSP with SOCOM U.S. Navy SEALs tactical strike. Tango, south of here. With an insurgent military force terrorizing South America, it's up to you and one of several playable international special forces units to snuff them out. However, as far as SOCOM games go, you'll be doing it a little differently. Tactical Strike controls more like a real-time strategy game, a change in gameplay that alleviates the problems a single analog stick setup can cause for a game like this on the PSP. Looks like to us. Fans might not be down with this at first, but fear not. The rest of the game is vintage SOCOM, boasting a wealth of varied missions. Target eliminated. Graphics as good as you can expect from the PSP, and a variety of multiplayer options. Oh, yeah. SOCOM US Navy SEALs Tactical Strike gets a four. Nice job, gentlemen. We're through. Out of five. <laughs>